All right, problem five looks like fun. Let the user type their full name with spaces between the name parts. Okay. Okay, name. Please enter your name. That sounds good. Split the name into parts. All right, so I'm going to use the split command. If I wanted to, I could explicitly say to split by spaces. If I leave that out, actually, it'll assume that it should split by spaces, but I'm going to go ahead and just put that in to make sure. So this is going to give me a list of parts of the names. So I need to um, extract the first letter of the first and last name. So let's get, get the first letter of the first name. Um, yeah, that'll work, but um, this is actually more complicated. So let's let's go here and say um, get the first name. Okay, first name is name split zero. That sounds good. Get the last name. Last name is name split minus one. That gives me the last item in the list. Okay, now I want to get the first letter of first letter of the first name. Okay, so first name initial, which is what it is, is going to be the zeroth character in the first name. Now get the first letter of the last name. Cool, that's what I want. That's the last name initial. So I'm going to go to the last name and get the first character of that. Convert them to lowercase and concatenate them into a single string. So I could do that in another step, or I could just go up here and say dot lower. That would apply the lower method to the initial as I generate it. I could also do it in a, another step, but that would just put, create more li lines of code. Now I should concatenate the initials into a single string. So let's create a string called initials. And that's the first name initial plus last name initials. Print the initials. And I need to tell the user that it is their initials. So I will say Your initials are initials. Okay, let's try this. So please enter your name. Your initials are SB. Okay, let's try again. How about... John, Jacob, Jingleheimer, Schmidt. Oh, that's Gingleheimer, not Jingleheimer. Your initials are JS. Let's try one more tricky thing here. Interesting. Okay, so if I just say Zeus, 
then the first name and the last name are the same thing. So I'd probably need to do something special here to just have a single Z as the initial.